Sleepwalker is a great piece. To me, it, it's, a, it, it, it's a very clear sculpture of um, ambivalence uh, and, and even hopelessness. Um, and it, the one that the male sleepwalker that was outside at the university um, is the first one I made to uh, actually be uh, able to be put outside. And the other ones were interior sculptures. Uh, so this one, in, it, by making it in bronze, painted bronze, we uh, expanded its potential environment, you know, its potential landscape. So the narrative of the sculpture is, when you put him outside, then, then he's even more hopelessly lost, in a sense. You know what I mean? Like, he's even, the, just the narrative is much stronger that way. Um, if the figure is inside still, he's still sleepwalking, but he's not profoundly lost. This sculpture in the meadow, or in the woods, or by a stream, is profoundly lost. You know, he's profoundly out of place. And I think that there's a fragility and, um, and a kind of existential... Um, poignancy to that to that sculpture in that way. I understood the controversy surrounding that piece, although um, it felt it felt um, arbitrary in a way, and it also didn't feel like it had much to do with the sculpture. Um, it was a time in university politics uh, in America where everyone was kind of talking about um, a kind of a new uh, second wave of political correctness, where uh, it, and where they call it trigger warnings, this sort of thing. So. The sculpture was just a, a something, a vehicle for this conversation in a way, uh, and it got real. And it was like really easy to make fun of too in this situation because it was all it was an all women's college, and they were you know the headlines were really stupid you know all all women college terrified by statue you know this kind of stuff that was like really easy to make fun of, so it it got blown out of proportion and everyone got just crazy about it. Uh, yeah, the sculpture got well known, but you know what? The sculpture got well known for the wrong reason, unfortunately. So I think the idea was that we pull the sculpture out of circulation after that because I wanted, I didn't want people to think about that controversy anymore when they saw the piece because now all of a sudden the piece was about that and it had all of that shit on top of it that wasn't about the work at all. And, it, and so I wanted to reclaim the, the, the conceptual value that I put into the work. So we took it out of circulation for a little while and then we'll... We'll present it again, and hopefully it'll be fresh at, at that point, you know?